We begin with the latest headlines in the COVID-19 outbreak. Eight new deaths bring Minnesota's total to 87 lives lost. There are more than 1,800 known cases, but more than half of those patients have recovered. 93 are still in intensive care. And the latest numbers out of Wisconsin show more than 3,500 confirmed cases and 170 deaths. In the U.S., there are more than 610,000 confirmed cases of COVID-19. More than 26,000 people have died. Richfield-based Best Buy said today it will furlough about 51,000 hourly store employees. They'll get to keep their health benefits for at least three months. CEO Corey Berry will forego 50% of her base salary through at least September 1st. The president of United Health Group and CEO of Optum, Andrew Witte, is taking a leave of absence so he can help lead the World Health Organization's efforts to come up with a vaccine for COVID-19. Witte is the former CEO of GlaxoSmithKline. The Minnetonka-based United Health Group said today it won't seek federal help to make it through the coronavirus outbreak. The nation's largest health insurer reported first quarter earnings above Wall Street projections. And here is a live look at Wall Street now. The Dow is down around 500 points. Bank of America and Citigroup said today that their profits sank more than 40 percent in the first quarter.